Thanks, Jenna. Our next guest, Tony Rajunas, graduated from Notre Dame in 1988. He has leveraged his Notre Dame education into being a true force for good. Welcome to the show, Tony. Thanks. So I came here in the fall of 88. Your timing was a little off. You should have stayed for a Masters. Something really great happened that fall. We won the national championship right after you left. What the heck? <laughs> Talk to me about your time at Notre Dame. What did you study and what were you involved in? Um, well, hey, first, thanks for having me here. I'm super excited about helping raising money for Notre Dame financial aid. Um, I couldn't have gone here without financial aid help from uh, the Jack Melcher Scholarship Fund. So I want to thank Jack for that. Um, it's really special for me. Um, when I was here, I was a finance major. Um, and I ran track with uh, Nick Sparks, another finance alumni who pivoted to a new career too. Yes, so a highly I had a successful great time. one. <laughs> I had a great time when I was here. Excellent, I'm so, so glad to hear that. After Notre Dame, talk to me about the first part of your career. Um, pretty straightforward, Notre Dame finance degree, 30 years in the finance world. I will say I, uh, my spreadsheets were nearly as nice as my paintings. <laughs> this is so. very good to hear. And now, what are you doing and how have your dual interests in business and art uh, affected your success in life? Um, art is a um, Notre Dame business degree. The business world teaches you to have a great product, um, take care of the customers, um, and you know the sales take care of themselves. I've been lucky to do gallery shows in major cities, Seattle, um, Raleigh, Denver, Atlanta, and I've been lucky to have great customers who are enthusiastic fans who support my art. That's but great. it's really about business model. That's awesome to hear. Um, your new company, Method Arts, is located in Atlanta. Is that where most of your art is existing? And talk to me about the mission of this work. Um, the mission of uh, Method Arts is to fill the gap between um, funding for art education in the public space. It's usually the first thing that gets cut. And uh, so we are trying to create custom pieces like this um, that we sell and we donate 100% of the proceeds to charity to really fill the gap. I work with Callenwald, which is a fine arts center in Atlanta and we're doing an outreach program for Title I school kids. Um, we're doing it for underprivileged seniors and uh, veterans. So in general, it, uh, um, we're really trying to raise money to fill a gap that the schools aren't taking care of. That's a really cool model. I looked at the website and I was very impressed with what you're doing. We understand you've created a special piece for Notre Dame Day uh, entitled Under a Blue Gray Sky. Tell us about it. Um, so this is one of my favorite jobs. I'm a Notre Dame alumni. I usually, I like to create, take iconic images and brands and merge them into something different. I don't tend to do landscapes. I don't tend to do traditional scenes. Um, I 100% spray paint these. And uh, um, in this case, it's a, I'm only selling this for Notre Dame days only. There's 88 versions of it. Um, normally, we'd sell these for $1,500 in a gallery. We're selling it for uh, $900. And uh, I think it's really a unique piece that people could add to their collection. It's really so distinctive. My originals tend to sell for $15,000 to $20,000. Um, and I'm hoping people will like this one. Uh, it's stunning. It's really cool. And, and such, it would be such a conversation piece. Everyone would want to know, where did you get it? There you go. <laughs> but the story is even better because you say, not only do I have this wonderful piece to enjoy, but it's having a real impact on others' lives. 100% of the sales and proceeds are going to charity. So that's really what my business model is. I want to make uh, my art help kids develop their, their artistic side. A so. true force for good. Thank you for all you're doing, and thanks for your support of Notre Dame Day. Thank you. Appreciate Take care. Uh, we're going to toss it over to Joe now.